M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So what is a network radio? We've got two here, and this one actually here, which is a W5, actually has a 70 centimeter transmitter, real radio as they say, inside, but also it's Android 7, and it runs apps like Droid Star, which is on there now. Here is Zello, and then we've got Peanut on here. This one here, which is called a W2 Plus, also known as the N60, is like a desktop version. It has a nice wired fist microphone that you can see here. And they just work great. And the good thing is that they, they do cross over onto amateur radio because you can run an app like Droid Star here on any of these devices and it will use D-Star, DMR, Fusion. You can also run Blue DV with an Ambi server and use the same device on the same mode. The, the very common one is is Zello, which you can see running here. And now I am a member of a group of channels, and I, oh, please join these channels. I'll put a link in to the description here. I know it's a bit bright there. Let's see if I can dim it down a bit. Network radios uh, owned by G1YPQ, very friendly people, but the good thing about it is that it does allow licensed and non-licensed radio enthusiasts to all be in the same place. And there's channels from naught to naught to six here. So just drop me a line if you're having problems. The other one that's excellent by by PA7 LIM is Blue DV. Now these apps can run. Some of them can run simultaneously. We've got Peanut here. We can log that in. Now we've got some activity there. And Peanut can run on any of these devices. This is an Android tablet, 120 pound. Look at it, 10 inch, and it's got Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. You know, we've got I've got a, a couple of Bluetooth keyboards here, and they work great. You can hear Peanut there. Now the other one, the the other one is you can if you hold your finger down. Let me just check. I think it's one of these. I always get confused which one it is. There you are. You can go like hold your finger on it, and you can get split screen. And then you can run two things at the same time. Like so. And it, it can do that on any of these devices. Now, the Android version is a newer version if you buy a nice new tablet. I find the whole experience is fun, you know, regardless of whichever one you're using or just use your normal standard mobile phone. Works great as well. I've got a Galaxy S22, and that's fantastic. They have Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, so you can pair... Bluetooth headsets with them and they're inexpensive you can buy a, a a network radio like this and this one if you want the this is a 3G device if you want the built-in radio I think it's about 130 pound delivered from AliExpress the newer model which is a W6 doesn't include the 70 centimeter radio I'll see if I can just fire that up because it's been a while since I've used that I tap here and then we need to go to the apps there's a it is an app although but it is controlling a proper radio inside. Let's just push the PTT. And that is a, a real radio. And I'm trying to look at my memory. It does have memory channels. All Star 2. Let's try that. Like so. Enable. Enable just means it turns it on. And then we've got my All Star node here within the house. And that, if I transmit, is a proper radio signal. That's my All Star node coming from this antenna. So this is one of my favorite ones because of that, because it does everything. Uh, you, the downside is you, they don't make them 4G, but saying that, I never ever use the, the SIM card because uh, these can all have SIM cards, which is fine, but you, it's a lot easier just to pair it with your phone. So how do you pair it with your phone? You literally just turn on. I'm not sure if you have the ability on this tablet. Just turn on mobile hotspot. I, I, I think this tablet which is a Lenovo M10, doesn't have a SIM card, so we can't do it with this. I'm just seeing if it will share Wi-Fi. It's actually a very good question. So I'll have, <coughs> I'll have to look into that. But overall, my main thing is that, you, you know, you can run all these different apps. You can run Echolink. Echolink works brilliant. You can access everything you can think of with Echolink as well. It's pure all RF contacts. So you can hear we've got some work going on in the garden there, so I suppose I'd better end the video. But I'll just show you Echolink here, which again, you can run on two windows. And the other one we saw there, just when I was looking, was Droid Star uh, as well. So check it out, I and mean, this is fantastic. I've got some more network radios coming soon, and uh, for testing, it's gonna be fun. 
and the other one is the Pico APRS. So thanks for watching my channel. 7-3, catch you on now. All the best.